Hello everyone, Marek Mulacic here and welcome to another video. Uh, this time it's going to be Premiere, as you can see. <laughs> and this is going to be a quick tutorial, a quick video on how to create a glowing effect on a video or video or animation in here. <clears throat> uh, this is going to be a quick one. So I've got this video here that looks like something like this. Video animation in there. And if you want to turn it into glowing edges and the background being say black or black and white for example or white you can choose as well <clears throat> you can do this in here you don't need After Effects for that you would apply an effect called uh, find edges so you can go to your effects panel you can just search for edges or edge even edge and you find edges under stylize remember if you have the video already selected you can just simply double click on the effect to apply it and you normally get something like this by default with glowing edges. <clears throat> if you'd rather have, say, a darker background and show the content with glowing edges instead, you can tick invert in here. I would probably prefer this. Uh, you can also adjust blend with original in here. So if we increase the value, it's going to show more of the actual content. Or if you set it to 100%, all you're going to see is just the original video like before. So you could adjust a little bit, but I'm going to just leave it at 0%. I'm going to take invert because I'd rather have it on a black background with the lighter edges around. So get something like this. <coughs> and it's finding the edges within the video clip automatically. If you wanted to say, maybe have the colors warmer, for example, you can also apply another effect, uh, which is under Video Effects and uh, Channel, which is the Invert. Now, I know we have the Invert in Find Edges. I just applied Invert, I ticked Invert on Find Edges. So what's the point? Well, Invert, Invert Effect has some extra options. So if I apply Invert Effect, initially it's going to look the same as before. Before we apply, before we ticked Invert on Finding Edges. Okay. So now in here, on the Invert effect, you've got this channel drop-down menu. So you could do like red, for example, you can have a background in red, or green, or blue, uh, maybe. <laughs> or HLS, which goes back to white, we've got a hue here as well, which actually is going to make it black. So if we apply a hue on a channel, we're getting the same effect as I was getting earlier with just fine edges. But especially this area here, which is more colorful, the inside in here, we can actually customize the colors a bit by changing the channel to either in-face chrominance, so they're getting more yellowish, orangey, reddish, <clears throat> or you've got quad quadrature chrominance as well, where they're getting, well, from what I've seen here is quadrature, quadrature, however you pronounce it, chrominance will make these colors cooler, where in face will make them warmer. And with fine edges, we had uh, cooler colors by default. So if you like the cooler colors, you're good to go. You don't need to apply invert in here. But if you want the colors to be warmer, you can use in face chrominance in here. Uh, you can obviously apply a tint effect for example, so if I go to color correction here, you can do the tint, you know, it's going to make, make it black and white, but you can also map blacks to certain color. So say blacks could be more reddish, or the whites could be different color, they could be maybe more yellower, for example. So you could tweak, in this case, you can tweak the background and the foreground, you could say as well. Okay. But I actually like this in the original version, so I'm going to, well, I'll keep the tint in here, I'll just turn it off. I actually quite like this effect in here, so I get something like this. An interesting glowing edges effect with the, within the video, within the animation, making everything more colourful in a way as well in here. With just a couple of effects, couple of effects uh, right inside Premiere. So this was just a quick tutorial this time in Premiere for glowing edges for one of the effects in here. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm Marek Mulajic from MarekMulajic.com. Please subscribe if you haven't already. If you have any question, questions, just let me know in the comments. 
and hopefully see you in another video. So thank you for watching. Bye bye for now. Bye bye.